Hello. So sometimes you are you are typing or you're using the keyboard and you require some symbols. And you discover that some of those symbols are always uh, not on the keyboard. Windows has an accessory, a Windows accessory called Character Map. Now, one of the usefulness I found out with Character Map is um, in helping you locate the symbol, the currency symbol. Um, that you can use in in your document be it in Word, Excel or any other application or software you're using that Windows has a special accessory or Windows has an accessory called character map that can help you locate your currency symbol okay so here you have Okay, so here it is, a, a character map. Now in the character map, you have a whole lot of symbols and characters. You can find virtually all the currency symbols in character map. And there are a whole lot of characters. But today, um, I'm looking at currency symbols. Okay, so right here, this represents um, an amount of money. Okay, but you see, in this case, um, probably the person does not understand. I see this a lot of time. So probably, and most times, the people don't understand. The person who has put up the document does not understand that uh, there is a symbol. You see, here it is Nigerian Naira. Okay, so person most times don't understand that there is a symbol, a currency symbol, a Naira uh, uh, currency symbol is there in Windows. Okay, so instead of writing that, um, head over to um, head over to char character map, and in character map, um, enable the you have to enable the advanced view if you are using it for the first time. Enable, check the advanced view uh, radio button, and then the search feature will come. Then there and then you can type in Naira. Click on search. See the Naira symbol appears. You highlight it and then click on select, and then click on copy. It's copied to the clipboard, so you can have say control v to paste it okay and then you can type oh okay um, so control v okay so this is the same thing as same thing as All right. So you can. This is how it should be with the symbol. Also, again, let's you can. If you are in the euro zone and um, you are looking for the euro symbol and it's not on your keyboard, assuming it's not on your keyboard, character map will help you locate it. So you head over to character map, um, you reset this field, take off, remove what is there, and you do a quick search for the hero. Uh, click on search. See, the hero symbol appears. You highlight it and then you select, select and copy, and then head over to your document, control V, control V will paste it. And then you have something like that. 
very easy and nice to use. Okay, at the same time, if you are looking for the pound or the British pound, okay, let's say you have a keyboard and on the keyboard um, it is not there, so you can do a quick search for it. Type Oh, sorry. Um, so you do a quick search for it. Um, search. There it is. Click on it. To highlight. Then select it and copy it. Then head over to your document. Control V. Control V. Paste it. Then. Oh la la! You have it there. That's pound. Okay, so whatever it is, um, so long as you know the name of your currency, so long as you know the name of the currency in the, of the country where you are, Windows character map will help you um, with the symbol. And of course, you know, for instance, I have um, I, I have a um, an American keyboard, a US keyboard, and right on it, um, the dollar sign is there. So if I hold down the shift and press uh, four, right, on top of the key key with the figure four is the is the dollar sign. So there it is. Okay, so no matter the country you are, you can get the symbol, the currency symbol of that country by just um, by just doing a quick search in in, in Windows um, character map. However, um, this is assuming that. The symbol it is it it's not on the on the keyboard of the country where you are. So quickly head over to character map um, and you can character map will uh, help you with the symbol. Okay and. Um, Again, you can get character map by going to start. Start, you scroll down, look for Windows accessories. Okay, here you have Windows accessories. And then in Windows accessories, see, there it is. Character map. See, there it is in Windows accessory. You click on it. It gets populated and... There it is. Bear in mind there are so many other symbols and characters that you can get from character map. But for the purpose of this video, I'm just looking at just looking at um, currency symbols. Currency symbols. This is hoping this information um, has been useful. This is open, this the information passed here. Um, somebody somewhere will find it very useful. Thank you for your time. Thank you and please encourage this channel by subscribing. Thank you.